Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 6381 in Candy Crush Saga. If you find these videos helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. That'll allow me to continue providing these for you. So here we go. In this level, we've got 24 moves to clear out one, two, three, four cake bombs that are covered over in thicker and thicker layers of crystal candies. Plus, we've got to get 40 dark chocolate. Now, there is no dark chocolate on the board. That means we're going to have to rely on these guys to give us our dark chocolate. And the problem is we also have to get rid of them. So they're going to be throwing blockers out. We've got to really pay attention to what they're doing when. So I'm going to work on the cake bombs first. And I've got this thing to help me. Um, these are protected somewhat by the candy cane fences. I think right away what I'm going to do, well, let's see. These are going to have to throw out dark chocolate, right? Yes. And now the dark chocolate can start to grow. If I leave it, it'll grow, and so we've got another way to get it. But it only grows one per turn. So I think I'm going to hit this. It's going to be okay. I need to hit it sometimes. So I knocked out a rivet, it didn't produce, but I've got other things producing. And I'm just gonna have to keep real close eye on everything. I wanna move this over to here if I can. I've gotta get through these cake bombs. Yikes, that chocolate just, it's invasive. Uh, I can make a stripe, but then I don't see the value of that. Let's just kind of clear this out give ourselves more space. Uh, we still need 23 chocolate. We've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We need a lot more. I need to work in here and I can't seem to be able to get there from here. I know I hit that again. That's okay. I need to kind of hit it every so often so that when I'm ready to take it out, I can. Yikes, this is tough. Okay, now we need 18. I've got 3, 6, 9, 12, 14, 16, 18. I have all the chocolate on the board I need. See how I didn't plan for this well enough? It's going to keep spewing things at me, and I'm not prepared to take things out. I don't think I can drop a green in here. So I'm going to go ahead and make this stripe clear things out. Yeah, I let it get too wild. Oh, way too wild. So now I know I need to work a bit more on these guys. That's okay. Every time we play, win or lose, we better understand how the board operates. I think I'm going to be stuck here for a while. I don't think that this is going to go away easily. I'm going to hit these a little more frequently than I did in the past so that the chocolate can't get too crazy. When the chocolate is on the board, I'm not going to worry about trying to let it grow turn by turn. I'm going to take out the stray chocolate, and I'm going to do a better job of getting rid of the cake bombs, especially this one at the top because it's the low-hanging fruit. It'll help me to take off the crystal layers here, and then I'll be able to get this one, this one, this one. That's my plan of attack. I'm going to pause the recording, come back with a new board. I'll have the microphone turned off until I have something important to share.
Okay, so second try, I had almost all of the chocolate I needed, and I just had a few moves left, and I accidentally uh, took out the last of these guys because of cascading when I needed one chocolate, and so that failed. But this is looking pretty dang good here. I've got all the chocolate I need. Now I need to get to these guys. And here's the thing, they explode with force. So if I take out blue, it hits this, which then makes this explode, which hits this and hits this. It'll take this out entirely, which will hit this, which will explode. I think this is the way to do it. There we go, got it all done. So on the third try, I was able to get it done. It's that balance between letting the chocolate produce and then taking out those magic mixers. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.